the biggest question of all. Why go electric? Bus talk. Hi, my name's Sean Leach. I'm Director of Technology and Platform Management for Highland Electric Fleets. Hi, I'm Tim Shannon. I'm the Director of Facilities Planning Efficiency and Transportation for Twin Rivers Unified School District. And this is Bus Talk. All right, Tim, this is a big one today. The question is, why go electric? We could talk for hours on this subject. It's clean air for kids and community, quieter ride, being more efficient. But let's talk a little bit about energy savings and cost savings. The average electric bus costs 80% less to operate um, fuel-wise and 60% less in maintenance costs. Also, we can create career and technical education around it because it's technology of the future. We can train the new workforce to be technicians and not mechanics. Yeah. All right, Tim and I have talked enough about this. Let's take it out to Jim, who's a depot manager in one of Highland's districts. Yeah, let's see. Hi, Tim. Hi, Sean. Jim Beasley here. We're in my office now with the uh, bus depot. The people out here take care of business. The uh, drivers and the students really enjoy riding and driving on electric buses. They've been a very big asset to the depot. There's not a route that we have at the depot that the bus cannot do. Looking towards the future, the plan that's been shared with me is that more electric buses are coming. Uh, the drivers are very excited. This is a very good thing looking towards managing energy resources and having quiet, uh, non-polluting rides for students. What Jim said is exactly what happens when you electrify a fleet. Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, if this project went the way it's supposed to, it should be easy. You should just be doing the job you've been doing forever, which is safely moving kids every morning and every afternoon. And that is what Highland does, is we take all the other insanity around these projects and all the scope and the scale, and we handle it all for you. You can just stay focused on doing your job really well, and we're right there along with you to improve it day after day after day for the next 10, 15, 20 plus years. And we haven't even talked about sustainability. Yeah. You know, that's, the, that's a key component. I mean, there's 485,000 diesel school buses out there that do nothing for sustainability. Sustainability is a huge part about driving electric. Diesel fuel only comes from one place, whereas these electric buses, they run on electricity. We can make electricity in a ton of different ways. So the, the energy that goes into these buses is not only cleaner because it was made cleaner, but it's supporting local economies as well. You know, this energy is made locally and used locally, and it supports the local community. All right, Tim, that was a great episode. I'm Sean. I'm Tim. And this has been Bus Talk. Bus Talk.